Uh, g'day there, King's Kids. Just thought I'd take you behind the scenes and introduce you to uh, someone. Uh, this is one of uh, my executive producers, uh, Lithiana. G'day, Lithiana. Uh, g'day, Arnie. It's lovely to see you today. Lithiana's the voice of Nurse Betty. Yeah. Hello, boys and girls. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, there you go. A little secret is out already. Yeah. It's amazing to think that we are at this point in time right now here. I So you've done some great things over the weekend, honey. Yeah, I just chucked a few uh, renos uh, together, uh, planted some plants and, and uh, got myself a uh, new backdrop. Your, pretty... your home is just popping. This garden is amazing. Yeah, it looks pretty good, doesn't it? It looks fantastic, Arnie. Yeah, I had a bit of help, but just didn't do it all myself. Oh, yes. So some people came in and helped you? Yeah, just yeah, a couple of people. Yeah. Oh, man. Well, you need to keep those people around. This is absolutely fantastic. Yeah, I've, I've got a very talented crew around me. It's really good. Yeah. You know, I cannot believe, Arnie, that like 14 weeks ago, we kind of started this journey with your bosses, yep. Kimberly and Rob. You remember them? Yeah, I know them. Yeah, they, they, they're the CEOs of um, That's right. of uh, a boy family ministry. Well, those mm. two, we came and we sat outside back at, in March sometime and sat together with uh, uh, Pastor uh, Darren Pratt yeah. from Balloon Kaboom. Yeah. We always work with him. Mm -hmm. And man, every single week you guys have put something together. Like Amazing. an episode of King's Kids. It's a lot of hard work uh, yeah. getting a uh, episode out every week from scratch. Yeah. Uh, but it's worth it, uh, Letiana. I think Kimberly and Rob are just legends. And I'm so, so grateful to all of you for the work that you've done. It's been amazing. The World Church, I mean, all the children around the, our division and around the world are so grateful to, to you, Arnie, and your family here, and to Kimberly and Rob, and, and to uh, Junior and Liv there. I mean, all of those guys, you know, Troy, everybody, and all the kids. You know, I met them for the first time today, mm -hmm. all those kids. Yep. They're just fantastic, hey? Oh, the kids are great. We, we have a great time with them. Yeah. And, the, and, and the whole crew. The whole crew is just uh, awesome. All awesome the mums and dads people. and mm -hmm. all the families supporting each other. It's a real family ministries thing, isn't it? Oh, it is. It's a family yeah. ministry. That, yeah. That's a very good point, yeah. Lithiana. Yeah. Mm. And, and I'm just really excited uh, that we've been given the opportunity to do Series 2. I know, isn't it amazing? Yeah. I'm amazed at, about it as well. Yeah, it's just fantastic. Uh, I can't wait uh, for it to be on next weekend. That's the first one? Yeah, first one. Fantastic. Episode 1. Episode 1. Yeah. Looking forward to it. Oh, I am. I heard there's some new, new, new characters in there, though. Yeah, some new characters to look for. Looking forward um, to it. There's... Uh, Granny Grace. She tells stories, I hear. Yeah, she's going to tell Great storyteller. Story. And there's Sammy and Gemma. Yeah. Yeah. And there are a couple of kids that are going to be telling stories as well? Yeah, they're going to be telling stories and they're going to take us all the way back to the Bible. Oh, that's going to be fantastic. Yeah, like in a time machine sort of thing. Magic. <laughs> when we were asked to come together to, to put together King's Kids, I don't think we dreamed even then that it would be what it is right now. I just see the way that the Lord has worked and the way God has just blessed in the way, uh, in preparing you um, and your team to do all of this. Mm. I mean, honestly, Arnie, I mean, you have your grandchild, what's his name? Is it That's Shane? Shane, yeah. Oh man, Shane and you have such amazing conversations, you know, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and you're Good doing kid. all this stuff all the time. You've been doing this sort of ministry for years, haven't you? Ah, uh, yeah, a long time now. Yeah. Mm. And yeah. now it just sort of goes to the next generation and we've got new people coming on. But it's still the same story of God's goodness to us, eh? Yeah, it is. And yeah, we have a, I think we're only our third generation of kids. Seriously? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Wow. Yeah, that we have here filming. Yeah. It, it's fantastic. I think it's very important that uh, we make sure that we tell the kids of Jesus yeah. all around the world. I think it is. Mm -hmm. And children all around the world actually are enjoying um, King's Kids. Oh, that's great. Yeah. Yeah. So my children's ministries leaders, the people that I work with, uh, they love it. They ah. think it's absolutely fantastic. So please, I, I mean, extend to Kimberly and Rob. Let them know how much we love King's Kids. Oh, we'll do that. Thank next, you so next much. Next time I uh, see them. Thank you. And actually, they're not far away. <laughs> yeah. um, they, they're actually even listening. <laughs> yeah. You're such an egg. Okay, look, I've got a question here. What is your hope for the future of King's Kids? Oh, my future of King's Kids. Mm. Mm. Oh, I'd like to see it uh, go forever yeah. until Jesus comes. 
you know. And, and I'd like to uh, not just uh, cover the primary uh, Sabbath school lesson, but do other things as well. Mm. Um, maybe something like uh, Desire of Ages. Yeah. You know, yeah. make uh, that come alive for kids. For kids. Mm. Yeah. Wouldn't that be great? That would be fantastic. Putting it into context so that kids can understand it. Yeah. You know, what, you know, the desire of all, all, for all ages is what? That we know Jesus and we know him better. Yeah, that's right. And I think uh, that's coming. The people that have watched King's Kids, they've seen how you've been doing Discovery Bible reading mm -hmm. with Shane. You're doing e-giving. Yep. You know, you're just doing church, you mm -hmm. know. And kids are watching it and they're learning the methods really of Jesus of how to share the gospel, how to share their faith by reading the word and then going out and telling people. Uh, I love the crafts. I yep. love how the kids are doing things like that. And kids can do anything like that. Uh, these kids are really smart kids. And then there's truckloads of smart kids out there too. You know, they're all smart kids yep. and they all learn very quickly. And we just need to give children a chance. Yeah, that's right. Show. Yeah. Thank you so much, Arnie, for having me come visit tonight. Oh, it's great when uh, you come. Uh, Lidiana, yeah. is there something you'd like to say to the King's kids out there and their families out in King's Kids land? Yeah, and I think what I'd really like to say to mums and dads and to the children who are watching King's Kids uh, wherever you are, um, you know, we prayed over this um, ministry, really. We prayed over the stories, uh, the crafts, the children that are involved. And, you know, we... we we come together every week really um, to tell you the story of Jesus' goodness. And our prayer really is this, that as mums and dads, you're the heroes. You get to help your children meet Jesus. And if Arnie and the family here can help you do that in some small way, then that's the purpose of what um, King's Kids is about. Because we're all, the ch all children of God and I pray that you will know that you're prayed for in your ministry, in your homes to your children. God bless you. Yeah, we'll see you later on. Yep. Good on you. I'm a king's kid. Yes, I'm a king's kid. Yeah, it's a great song. It's a it? great song. I'd yeah. love to sing that song with you sometime. Oh, that would be great. Yeah, be number one. Number one, all right.